We're working to improve the Hangman watershed in eastern Washington. It no longer provides the good habitat and abundant aquatic life that it once did. Land use activities such as timber harvest, road construction, urbanization, and agriculture have taken their toll. We're up here in the upper Hangman watershed um, near the state line on Mainstem Hangman Creek. And this is a, a agricultural, predominantly a dryland agricultural parcel um, that uh, we noticed had some water quality issues dur during one of our um, annual watershed evaluations that we do. The Hangman watershed itself is, is incredibly a valuable watershed. There's a lot of natural erosion that took place in this watershed before we started farming it. But that natural erosion has been um, exacerbated quite a bit by getting the water to flow off the landscape as quick as possible through um, channelization, ditching, dredging, and tiling. Our streams and rivers are plagued by too much sediment, high water temperatures, pathogens like bacteria, high nutrient levels, and low dissolved oxygen. Combined, these make our streams far less suitable for aquatic life, including fish. In this watershed, and like many others in the eastern region, it's just a little bit everywhere that adds up to a major problem. One of the keys to protecting water quality and restoring fish habitat is ensuring we have healthy, functioning, riparian, or streamside vegetation. Having the trees and shrubs in place not only protects wildlife habitat, but it also helps uptake the nutrients from our adjacent land uses. A lot of our effort is trying to establish large woody vegetation, tall trees and shrubs um, that will help shade the water to keep it cool. Cool water is critical for, uh, for aquatic life. When you think about what's going on with projects like these, you have to think long term. Plants and trees don't grow overnight. The effects of what we're doing now are the result of hard work and won't be realized for several years. As these plants and trees mature over the years, they'll do their job of cleaning and cooling the water.